Um, when we got into the Europa League at the end of last season, our aim straight away was to win the group. Um, you got our aim high. Uh, and I think for the amount of games that we've got coming up in the next few months, it was very important that we, we come top. Um, the manager's been able to change the team a little bit um, because we had such a good start to the group. Um, and tonight, I think, uh, if you look at the, the, the bench we had um, and the players that wasn't involved, um, to come here and get a 2-0 victory and clean sheet is is fantastic for us because we've we've been away to Wolves on Saturday um, and away trip, come straight to here, and then we're away on Sunday again against the one of the best teams in the world at the minute, so um, the boys need to rest and recover. Um, so it was important that players come in and stepped up and, and got the result that we needed. Erstes Europa League Tor für Sie, erster Platz in der Gruppe und Tottenham verliert in der Conference League. Wie fühlt sich das an für Sie? Also das mit Tottenham wusste ich erst gar nicht, aber als wir uns qualifizierten, da wollten wir natürlich äh, direkt Erster werden in der Gruppe. Das ist auch wichtig für uns, für die Moral, für die nächsten Spiele. Der Manager konnte das Team ein bisschen ändern und wir haben auch heute gesehen, wie stark die Bank war, Spieler, die gar nicht gespielt haben. Trotzdem konnten wir 2 zu 0 gewinnen, das ist natürlich ein fantastisches Gefühl, besonders mit den ganzen Auswärtsspielen, auch am Sonntag gegen Manchester City nochmal auswärts, da brauchen wir auch Ruhe für unsere wichtigen Spieler. Speaking about how much it was, how good it was that it was West Ham in the Europa League. So, what does it mean to you, a West Ham man through and through, that you've come top spot with ease with a game to spare? Um, because of the way that we're playing in the Premier League at the minute, and obviously the Carabao Cup, um, it's been, it's been um, obviously sitting and, and, and watching most of the games in the Premier League, watching the boys and the way they play, is, it's been fantastic. Um, it's been a learning curve in a way because you get to to see the game from another view because I've I've um, been playing in the team um, for 17, 18 years in, in the Premier League and then when you sit back and you watch it, it's, uh, you see a different part of the game. Also, I've had I've been lucky enough to play in uh, Manchester United away, Man City at home uh, in the Carabao Cup and, and get victories and then also um, play in the Europa League which has been fantastic for me and the end of my career um, and it just shows you what a what a uh, strength in depth we've got at the minute in, in the players that we've got at the football club um, I, I don't know how many uh, how many changes the gaffer made today but it was a lot um, and we've come here and, and played against a really good team where I was really impressed the way they played in in at home in the London Stadium they passed the ball well uh, they all want the ball and um, even when it's, it's not going so well and they was 2-0 down, they still wanted to get the ball and try and play. So um, we missed a lot of chances tonight, which I'm disappointed with. But all in all, I think it was a good night for the football club. Vor dem Spiel in Zagreb haben wir mit dir gesprochen und du meintest, wie wichtig es ist, jetzt hier bei der Europa League dabei zu sein. Also jetzt habt ihr den ersten Platz. Wie, wie fühlt sich das an für dich? Ja, also da wir in der Premier League und auch im Carabao Cup gerade ganz gut spielen, ist natürlich das Gefühl im Team richtig super. Wir haben auch viel gelernt, die Lernkurve war sehr hoch in den letzten Wochen und Monaten. Ich bin jetzt seit 17, 18 Jahren im Team und wenn man das Team jetzt vergleicht mit früher, das ist schon ganz was anderes. Ich hatte auch schon großartige Auswärtssiege jetzt gegen Manchester City, Manchester United und jetzt noch die Europa League am Ende meiner Karriere, das ist natürlich ein super Gefühl. Und auch wie viel wir jetzt verändert haben hier in der ersten Elf bei diesem Spiel, Und ja, ich war sehr verblüfft auch, wie gut Rapid bei uns im Stadion gespielt hat. Heute hatten wir noch einige Chancen, die wir liegen gelassen haben, aber im Großen und Ganzen können wir sehr zufrieden sein. Jack. Mark, so touching on similar things. 18 months ago, someone told you you'd be sat where you are, top of the group, and into the last 16. Would you have, would you believe them? Um, to be honest with you, the way it's gone uh, in the last 18 months, I can't even remember where we was 18 months ago. <laughs> was that... Was that during COVID or? Right, <laughs> was it? Was it? Has it? Has it gone that quick? Um, look, listen. For for us coming back, if you go back a little bit further than that, come back from from being in lockdown and stuck in our houses and knowing we had to come back to fight a relegation battle, um, which the boys done fantastically well with the, with the manager, and then to fast forward till now to 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 being further fourth in the in the Premier League and. Um, and coming top of uh, a group that you, which is really tough, some really good teams in it. Um, 
is is pretty special. But uh, I know it's a bit of a cliche, but you don't you don't want to you don't want to uh, uh, to end it here. We want to keep on progressing. We've got a fantastic tie against Spurs away in the quarterfinal of the Carabao Cup. Um, <laughs> I think we've got a game every three days for the next two months, which is going to be tough. Um, but as you say, the gaffer the gaffer managed to change the team tonight um, and give the, the the boys that will probably play on Sunday a rest. So, um, as I said, for everyone, for the players that ain't been involved, for myself, it's uh, it's been a good night. When you for 18 months, someone said that you are now erst in this group, would you have believed it? Well, after the lockdown, it was of course natürlich schwierig für uns. We had to win the gegen den den Abstiegskampf gewinnen. Und jetzt sind wir Vierter in der Premier League und Erster hier in dieser starken Europa League Gruppe. Das ist natürlich ein tolles Gefühl. Und auch wenn es sich jetzt vielleicht ein bisschen klischeehaft anhört, wir wollen hier jetzt nicht aufhören. Wir müssen genauso weitermachen, jetzt im Viertelfinale des Cups gegen Tottenham. Und ja, in den nächsten Wochen und Monaten haben wir sehr viele Spiele. Deshalb hat der Team auch, äh, der Coach auch das Team heute verändert, damit alle Spieler für Sonntag dann fit sein können. Um, the stadium being empty, we can obviously hear a, a touch more than usual. Notice a few words of advice for Yamalenko after about 10, 15 minutes, and then he goes and scores. And how much of that is 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 your role now? Then? Um, yeah, of course. I mean, uh, look, listen, it's, it's it's all part of football. If if I'm not if I'm not doing what I'm supposed to be doing on the pitch, then I'd, be, I'd expect someone to tell me. Um, but it was great. Um, <coughs> it was great that he scored um, 10 minutes after because he can tell me to shut up and. <laughs> worry about myself, which is great. Um, that, that's the good thing about the, the change room we're in at the minute. You know, I can uh, we can I can say that Yama can disagree with what I think, but at the end of the day, we come in and um, and give each other a cuddle. He's got a, a really good goal and actually won me my penalty. So, <laughs> in all, I had to thank him in the end. Um, so yeah, it's, uh, all in all, it's a it's a good night and things like that happen all the time. It's just you can hear it because there's no fans. Um, when we first come back and play with no fans, you sort of was a little bit on mute. You didn't really know what you could say and what you couldn't because obviously the the the, the cameras and and everyone could hear it. But um, it's a real shame because I know it's it's such a great atmosphere here and they've got some fantastic fans and. It's a beautiful city, and um, it's just a real shame for myself and and the team that we 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 get to come here when it's when it's in lockdown because um, it is a beautiful country and a beautiful place to come and to come and play football. Ein weiteres Spiel vor leerem Stadion. Wir haben gehört, was Tito Jamalenko gesagt haben, und danach hat er direkt das Tor gemacht. Also was war da los? Naja, sowas gehört dazu. Man muss halt einfach miteinander reden und natürlich toll, dass er auch dann das Tor gemacht hat. Dann konnte mir auch sagen, dass ich mal die Klappe halten soll. Und am Ende des Tages helfen wir uns halt immer gegenseitig aus. Er hat auch dann meinen Elfer rausgeholt und ja, alles in allem war es eine tolle Nacht. Aber ja, sowas, äh, da muss man aufpassen, wenn keine Fans im Stadion sind, weil man nie genau weiß, was man sagen kann, was die Kameras alles mitbekommen. Ja, und sehr schade auch, dass das Stadion leer war, weil wir alle wissen, wie toll die Rapid-Fans sind. Das ist hier eine sehr schöne Stadt, ein tolles Land. Und ja, sehr schade, dass wir jetzt hier im Lockdown zu Besuch sind. Tom. Hi, Mark. Uh, sorry if this makes you feel old, but I did just look it up, and Sonny is literally half your age. How... I, that is, I, I could be his dad. We've already been through that. <laughs> <laughs> How do you feel playing with you know, a 17-year-old with all that talent and his whole career ahead of him? Do you know what? In, in fact, I'm just abs I feel sick that he didn't score at the end with his with a head hard just because... Uh, when, when you're involved in the game so much, you you forget how much it means as a young kid to, to come in and play in the Europa League. And uh, as a 17-year-old, he, he only trained with us a few days ago, and he was he done really well. He's he's been doing fant fantastically well in the, in the under 23, so he deserved his chance. Um, yeah, and I was just I was just gutted uh, that he, he 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 missed that chance. But um, he's a great kid. He, he he's a quick learner. Um, and as you say, yeah, you've you've mentioned how young he is and how old I am. And um, <laughs> when he ran over the other day and joined us, I, I worked out that I actually could be his dad. So it's uh, it's only similar though when when Teddy Sheridan comes to the club and I was I was a 17 year old and um, <clears throat> I looked at him as a father figure when we was playing football and he obviously uh, could have been my dad at the time as well. So it's quick. It's it's strange how quick it goes. Exciting to play golf and tell him the tee and the greens the other way. <laughs> yeah, oh, you've seen that, have you? Yeah, that, that's actually true. Um, 
uh, I was just proud of the free iron I ate that day because I was I was I was scared about shanking it off the tee and I ate flush but completely <laughs> in the wrong direction. So um, yeah, thanks Ted for telling everyone that. Sonny Perkins is halb so alt wie du. Du könntest rein theoretisch sein Vater sein. Wie fühlt sich das an, mit so jungen Spielern auf dem Platz zu stehen? Ja, also für mich persönlich war es sehr schade, dass er den Kopfball am Ende nicht reingemacht hat. Und ja, für mich, also wenn man zu lange spielt, dann vergisst man auch oft, wie speziell dieses Gefühl ist, wenn man so jung ist und dann so viele Möglichkeiten bekommt, in der Europa League zum Beispiel. Und diese Chance hat er auch heute bekommen. Diese Chance hat er auf jeden Fall genutzt. Er ist ein toller Typ. Er lernt sehr schnell. Und ja, so war das auch für mich früher, als ich hier mal angefangen habe. Die Zeit vergeht leider sehr schnell und jetzt bin ich am anderen Ende der Fahnenstange angekommen. How far can you go in this competition? Um, how far can we go? Uh, well, the further you go, the better teams you play, I think, for sure. Um, so, do I think we can... Have we proved this year that we can beat any team? Yes. Um, uh, but we got to take every game as it comes. I know everyone says that, but that the teams are so good, um, especially when the teams drop out of the Champions League, you play some some real big hitters, so um, it's important that we won the group so we, we get a bit of a rest from, from the Europa League because we've got so many games coming up. Um, but do I think we can beat any team? Yes. Will it be tough? Yes. But um, I believe in the players that we've got in the dressing room. How far do you think you come in this Wettbewerb? Yeah, so the further you come, the better you will be, of course, the opponents. But we have shown that we can beat everyone. Aber wir werden jetzt erstmal ein Spiel nach dem anderen nehmen und natürlich kommen dann auch die tollen Teams aus der Champions League zu uns nach unten in die Europa League. Aber es ist sehr wichtig für uns, dass wir jetzt hier mal den ersten Platz holen konnten. Jetzt haben wir ein bisschen Zeit bis März, aber auf jeden Fall, wir können jeden schlagen. Cool. Any more questions? Right. Thanks, guys. Thank you.